there's this Catholic priest, Father Greg Reynolds. He's from Melbourne, Australia, and he recently got excommunicated from the Catholic Church. And you would think, oh man, he's basically kicked out of the church. He can't take the sacraments anymore. He must have done something really awful. Like, what did he do? Did he molest somebody? Is he a pedophile or something? Because that's usually those, those people get hit with those type of punishments from the church. But no, he didn't do any of that. What he did is he said, I think it's okay for women to become ordained in the Catholic Church. And gay marriage? I'm fine with that. Like, I would ordain, you know, a, 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 a gay marriage. And the Vatican basically said, you can't do that. You're going against everything we stand for, and you're out of here. Like, you, you're excommunicated. You can't take communion anymore, which is a big deal to them. And here's the thing that really gets to me. We've been seeing so many headlines. I've even made a video about Pope Francis and how he's really out of the mold for a lot of Catholics because he's openly saying we shouldn't be focusing on these divisive issues like gay marriage and abortion and everything. But even though he could have said, you know, I'm okay with this father and, you know, he should not be excommunicated, he didn't do that. He actually he heard the whole presentation and he was fine with it. He agrees that this excommunication ought to take place. And that's the thing. For all the things this Pope is saying, let's not forget he is still bound by his Catholicism. And he has to follow the Catholic rules. He may be changing the tone and the rhetoric, but the substance is not changing. He is still you know, vehemently against gay marriage. He still says women can't be ordained in the Catholic Church. That's what the rules are, and the Pope has no desire to change that. And when this father, uh, Reynolds, came around and said, I disagree with all that, what did Pope Francis and the Vatican do? They said, all right, goodbye, you're out of here. I mean, that's the Catholic Church for you. And even under the new leadership, even under Pope Francis, that has not changed yet. My name is Hemant Mehta. I write for FriendlyAtheist.com, and we'd love to hear from you. Please leave a comment below and become part of this discussion.